Good morning, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to another vlog. I feel very much like a TV presenter here, but I just wanted to sit down and film the intro because it's no longer super early in the morning, it's like 11.30. I did my morning routine, I did some work, all that stuff, and I just wanted to start the vlog because I forgot to start it earlier. So today's Friday, I have some filming to do, I have to get back to some emails, I also have to make a couple of appointments because I will be traveling next week and I'm so excited. I am going back home. I'm gonna go and see my family. It's my niece's birthday, so uh, my sister is gonna make like a little party for her and I'm just so excited. I haven't been to any of her birthdays so far and I feel terrible now that I think of it because she's turning five, but we live far away, we live in different countries, so it's kind of understandable and also before like now she was just so little so i feel like it is more for us than it is for her clearly she wouldn't like be able to remember of course it will be nice uh, for me to be there and be present at least on pictures <laughs> and videos and whatnot but yeah i'm going this time so it is her, her fifth birthday i'm so so excited and i can't believe that she's five years old like I mean, it's just been crazy. Like it feels like yesterday when my sister came first time with her to Geneva when we lived there and we had such a great time. And it's like, it's like yesterday in my brain. Just, I remember her being so little, like playing on the floor in my office. So I have quite a few things that I wanna do next week. Probably I'll start like packing, getting some gifts, organizing things on Monday, because I think I just want to take the weekend off and just relax. I'm very, very excited to see everyone. It's always so nice and it gives me so much energy and puts me in such a good mood. Uh, also, I think it's a great way to start like the holidays and get into holiday spirit. So yeah, that is my little life update. Now, because it turned out to be such a beautiful day, I have to go outside. Like, I feel it's a sin to sit all day inside and work on my computer where I can do that later in the afternoon. I think I'm just gonna go and grab lunch outside. Quick outfit check before I head out. I had to come over and show you guys this little snuggly thing. I seriously feel like I'm gonna be wearing this on repeat, like up until I can, I don't know. Uh, it's this super fuzzy, soft uh, sweatshirt, like half zip up. I know it's a sweatshirt, but depending where you live, uh, you can wear it kind of like an outerwear. Today, I'm just gonna go outside like this. I have just a long sleeve uh, t-shirt underneath and it's pretty warm. So I'm gonna just go out like this, but definitely you can toss on a jacket on top if it's super cold where you live and you're gonna be so toasty and so bundled up. And I'm just wearing my little Air Jordans, black and white, and these Levi's jeans, they are 501s. I have been wearing these nonstop, so I had to get another pair of like gray or black wash jeans. I'm just gravitating towards these so much lately, so I want another like similar pair, maybe something just a little bit different, like a different cut. But yeah, this is my little look of the day, super cozy and just snuggly and soft, and I'm so excited to go and try that Poke Place. It is just crazy to me how much the weather affects my mood and I know it's not a breakthrough thought and everyone feels like that but it's just insane for me like the difference in my mood and just like energy levels and how productive I get when the sun is out.
cool today. I still haven't had my morning coffee, so I think I'll have to talk to you when I get back home and get some caffeine in me. I almost abandoned this vlog yeah initially I thought I was gonna film like a weekend in my life that's why I started the vlog on Friday but things kind of took a turn it wasn't actually a super fun weekend we just went to play golf on Saturday and then uh, we both started feeling a little bit under the weather and um, Giacomo actually got sick so he's at home working from home this week and I got better so knock the wood I'm fine so today is Wednesday I finished up quite a bit of work on my computer I had to submit some things and just wrap things up before I start getting ready for my trip that I I think I told you about the trip on Friday so I am about to pack right now I took a shower I'm gonna wash my hair tomorrow I'm leaving tomorrow evening so I have a full day at home uh, and I want to wash my hair like the closest possible to my trip so it's like all nice and fresh. I feel like I sound so tired all the time, but it's just this dark, you guys. I can't stand how short the days are. Like it's so dark so soon and it feels like I'm ready for bed and it's not even like 4 p.m. So yeah, it's just weird. hate getting ready under artificial light because like you can't really see so now I see that I look pretty pale compared to my neck but it's okay so I am ready I'm gonna show you let me show you my little outfit okay so this is my little outfit of the day super cozy I'm meeting up with my sister my niece my mom and we're all gonna go and grab breakfast and coffee and I am so hungry and I need my coffee I usually have my coffee like in the first hour or so when I wake up and I have just been in the hotel room I didn't want to have one because I just want to enjoy my first coffee with them but yeah this is my little fit of the day I'm just wearing this black jeans they were actually super long and I just cut them off like before leaving so I don't know how this raw ham looks like but yeah I never wear these jeans because they're like so long and I need to wear like some heels or booties and then I never end up wearing them so I just cut off uh, a chunk at the bottom so I can wear them with my flats like so little uh, mini Uggs and this sweater that I got from Arkit I'm gonna link everything that's linkable down below if you guys want to check it out now I need to put a jacket and go downstairs I hear my sister she's probably texting me to come down so let's go
far this vlog is well not going anywhere uh, meet my sister hi <laughs> this is hi, the hi. first time you're in the vlog actually I think it's not yeah maybe not maybe not maybe second time. yeah maybe second time but we definitely have to do more vlogs together so yeah I haven't filmed much uh, this day because we just went for breakfast this morning you guys saw some clips already and also I don't know how much you can hear me now because it's really loud we're on the street but we just went for an appointment and then we're gonna go to another place basically it's like a bar hopping day so we're gonna go to another place we're gonna grab some champagne maybe some cakes Chocolates. yeah <laughs> and we'll Comfort bring you guys food. along with us little tiny tripod and now we have this very weird angle but good morning I just woke up and took a shower and just put on some clothes and I'm about to go downstairs and grab breakfast I'm in a hotel room look uh, I am so sorry for this vlog because I just realized it's going to be a crazy one I started a vlog last week when I was prepping for this trip I hope it's gonna be a pleasant one anyways yesterday I had a first full day like with the family we went to get some brunch it was so nice I love the place it's like a new little boutique hotel that my um, mom discovered then we had a full day of like running errands and stuff and it was just a crazy hectic day then I spent the evening at my mom's and we watched a football match a soccer match so it is day two of my stay here in Belgrade I have this weirdest lighting on my face because the window is there. Let me see if I can face the other way. Okay, it's fine. But today is day two of my stay and it is my niece's birthday. Uh, it's an early birthday because she's five years old, so it's gonna start at 1 p.m. Now it's 10. I am going to go downstairs and grab myself some light little breakfast. I don't think I'm gonna eat a lot because there's gonna be food at the birthday party, so yeah I'll just grab some fruit or something I don't know what inspires me and I have to do some editing unfortunately I would love to do something else but I am a little bit late I wasn't able to finish up a video for the last week so I'm gonna edit that probably uh, put it on upload before I leave for the birthday party and then hopefully it's gonna be up today so you're gonna be able to see it before this vlog so that's pretty much the plan so far I also would love to get a workout in in the afternoon because they have an amazing gym here in the hotel we stay in this hotel pretty much every time we come here and if we don't have like another place to stay we usually stay in this hotel and um, yeah I just love their gym it's really big and it's like a proper gym so yeah that's pretty much the plan for the day a lot of fun stuff <laughs> breakfast I just had a coffee some fruit uh, and a hard-boiled egg just to keep me a little bit full I'm very tempted to go and get myself some Starbucks because there is one just down the street like three minutes walk from here but I don't know maybe I don't need that much coffee I already had a cappuccino downstairs so I'm going to get ready like do my makeup I already showered so I'm gonna do my makeup and get dressed because I have like two hours before I need to go and I'm gonna do some editing and some work on the computer and then 
yeah i'll talk to you guys when i get going to the birthday party i already gave my niece her present yesterday and she was so excited i got her like a mini piano like a keyboard it has all sorts of sounds and a little microphone she can record herself and she was so excited but apparently she's in the phase of like singing and um just the music she's obsessed with it she's singing in a choir so she's kind of like obsessed with music right now and uh, that was like a perfect gift uh clearly my sister told me <laughs> but um yeah she was so happy and now i'm her favorite aunt according to her i don't know how happy my sister is gonna be because probably she's gonna just like keep playing around the house but it is what it is that's when you have kids so yeah, enough rambling. I'm gonna put a little bit of makeup. I don't wanna put like a lot of makeup because I feel like my skin is not the best currently. Like it's struggling. I feel like I have some inflammation. Like I don't have breakouts or anything because that's not what I normally get. But my skin becomes more sensitive. It looks a little bit more dull. And also I start getting more redness like around the cheek area and i wake up and i don't feel like i have like a very fresh skin it looks a little bit like dull and just old and like i don't know it's not nice uh also i have been noticing i have like a little bit enlarged pores in this area so maybe i am using a product that my skin doesn't like i have a feeling it's something about my makeup so i have a feeling that it's not about skincare because normally like in the morning or in the evening right after i do my skincare routine it's all good and my skin looks much better but then i think like when i take off my makeup i notice it doesn't look so good i'm suspecting i've been using maybe a little bit too much powder because lately i've been like enjoying that super matte look and right after you put a powder i think it's like a vicious cycle because when you have enlarged pores clearly when you put a little powder it makes the pores disappear and they look smoother same with like smoothing primers like the silicone primers they do the same thing where they make your pores look nicer and they smooth things out like temporarily but then when you take it off i feel like your pores are even more clogged than they start suffering i don't know the whole pore thing is up for debate i mean probably not up for debate probably dermatologists will tell you like no it's not up for debate pores are there they're there you can't get rid of them but it's true that sometimes they look larger sometimes they look smaller and tighter so i'm gonna try and just go like very very lightweight on the face just to blur a little bit the imperfections and the redness anyways i went to the kids birthday party who cares about my makeup oh you guys i'm so sleepy i feel like this coffee was not enough. I am so used to my like larger coffees that I make for myself at home and I sip them for a lot longer. And now I just had this like small little cappuccino that I had to kind of like chug. So I'm feeling like I do want another coffee. Should I just go and get myself a Starbucks? Maybe I should because I also need to edit. I have some other stuff that I need to get to. So maybe I need to be awake. Am I making excuses? but i promised myself even if i go to starbucks i'm going to cut down the syrups like i'm not gonna do any like white mocha or vanilla or caramel none of the syrups because yeah i just really want to try and cut down the sugar intake i honestly feel like that's what's been causing this mess on my skin like oh i hate it now when i look in the mirror i'm like i can see all my pores I regret not bringing my Sony camera because it has that like smooth skin filter and I know it's problematic and I know probably we shouldn't be using them but sometimes you just need a little something to make you look cuter but no I don't have that camera so here it is my poor filled face <laughs> Okay, so I just got a call from my mom. She's here. She's in the lobby. I'm going to go downstairs and meet her. So I'm not going to be working after all because I completely forgot we agreed to meet up in the hotel and chill here, have a drink uh, downstairs at the hotel bar and then go to the birthday. So it is what it is. I'm going to go downstairs and meet her and then I'll probably come back with her upstairs to the room so I get ready. And she also needs to try a pair of pants that she doesn't know if she's going to wear long story but yeah we're gonna be back in the room probably so no work for me obviously no starbucks but um yeah i don't know why i did this check-in like what am i telling you guys nothing my mom is here i'm gonna go meet her
I'm gonna vlog more today because it's gonna be a pretty chill day We don't have much planned. I was supposed to meet up with my friend She just recently delivered her baby and I still haven't met him So I was supposed to meet her but unfortunately her husband was not feeling well yesterday He had fever so we don't know like if we're gonna meet up what we're gonna do maybe tomorrow Maybe we wait and see like how he feels also like if she didn't get the bug So yeah, we'll see if we're gonna do that But um, that's misfortunate because I was really looking forward to meeting him and also going to see their place because they moved into the new apartment but um yeah that's probably gonna be on hold for now and then later on in the afternoon we're gonna go to the movies with my niece i am so excited you guys i love watching like kids movies it's my favorite thing in the world but i just don't really do it by myself i don't know why like sometimes maybe at home i would play a kids movie but not so often i definitely wouldn't go to the movies to watch it but yeah, we're gonna bring my niece to watch a movie. I think it's gonna be in 3D, which is always fun. So that's the plan for today. I'm gonna meet my sister and my niece um, soon, and then we're just gonna go for a little walk, maybe grab a coffee, probably grab lunch, and then yeah. Ja, das ist ein bisschen zu gut. 